I think there's overwhelming evidence that aviation has been a force for good. It's reunited continents, it's brought people together, it's created dialogue. I think people of my generation didn't start flying till their late teens or early 20s. It just was not affordable. Now it is such an affordable commodity, people are now taking the opportunity to go and visit friends, to go and see family members, to create social unity on a global scale. One of the biggest problems we have as an industry is a lack of cohesive thinking across all the various elements of supply chain. The big difficulty is people end up pursuing initiatives in silos and we will not get the benefit of bringing all that together to create a better experience unless we work together as an industry. And we have to do that because aviation infrastructure is becoming a scarce resource and the creation of more infrastructure is politically and sustainably more difficult to achieve. So using our existing infrastructure more efficiently and effectively by introducing new processes and technologies will create more capacity, but most importantly, a far superior joined up customer experience. We find that people are far more receptive to give access to data that enables their travel to be so much easier than with the legacy processes and the privacy issues that you might have thought would be top of the agenda if there's a benefit are actually quite secondary. The degree of adoption of the technology for the trial was very very high and we're very pleased that actually the trial was a success and we look forward to rolling it out across a transfer journey so hopefully we can be the join in the centre of two airports using the same seamless technology.